American couple by Mexican pirates on the waters along the Texas border. Today, Governor Rick Perry demanded that the body of David Hartley be recovered from Falcon Lake within the next 48 hours. Leanne Gregg has more. Shot to death on a lake that runs between the U.S.-Mexican border. That's what Tiffany Hartley says happened to her husband, David, while they were jet skiing last week on their way to take photos near an old partially submerged church. The attackers, Mexican pirates. Are you sure that your, your husband got shot? Yes, he in his head. Afterwards, authorities across the border questioned Tiffany's story. I don't have the photos that we were taking. I don't have anything except for my word. But a sheriff overseeing the case on the U.S. side says a witness corroborates Tiffany's account of what happened. Based on what we have, there's nothing really that would have me doubt her story at this time. In fact, he says he's been warning people for months about that area becoming a haven for pirates, some preteens who barely know how to use a weapon. The one thing that I dreaded the most uh, came true. And what happened is described by Tiffany as a horrifying ordeal, her husband dying as she was forced to flee for her life. And now, more than a week later, continued pleas for help from Mexican officials to find David's body and return it to his family. In McAllen, Texas, family and friends mourned their loss. He was an amazing guy with so much to offer this world. But I guess God needed him more than we do. Honoring a man who loved Harley's adventure and living life to the fullest while investigators search for answers. Leanne Gregg, NBC News. David and Tiffany Hartley had been married eight years and had reportedly planned to move from Texas back to Colorado, where David's family lives. The sheriff said there have been other reports of pirates in that area within the past five months, but this is the first reported death.